Thank you again. Well, Francis is going to sing another song with a real message here. It's called Take Up Thy Cross. <laughs> we recently uh, got the invite to go down to a local Christian radio station, KGRV and record a lot of these gospel tunes for their Celebrate Jesus Radio Hour that aired yesterday. And, uh, You'll hear it today at 1 o'clock. At 1 o'clock? You can hear it again today? I'm not sure we want to hear it, though. <laughs> Does anybody want to hear it? I mean, they just had this one broadcast mic there for a DJ, you know, we gathered around it. and Bribed him. Yeah, you'll definitely hear a lot of Francis on the radio today. So that's why we're giving you a little preview of what's coming out at 1 o'clock today on KGRV. AM 700. AM 700, okay. That was about the time that the banjo player, uh, Pappy Adams, started playing this morning's uh, 0700. Woke me up. It's a thing we have as banjo players to wake people up. I found out that he's uh, from a Marine Corps family. He was a Marine and his three sons... Uh, our Marines. Fortunately, one of them was lost in Afghanistan, but um, our heart goes out to his family, and uh, that's probably why he was up at oh dark thirty picking his banjo to get warmed up this morning. But being a Marine like he is, I understand. And so here we have that beautiful song, "Take Up Thy Cross." Oh, 
a little white church. All right, we started off our set this morning with the Old Country Church. And if you've been to the Old Country Church around Oregon, you'll probably know it's a beautiful white color. And uh, most of them are white. And, and this does happen to remind me of the last time Mac and I were painting the uh, church out in Looking Glass. We volunteer out there at the little community of Looking Glass to help them out. And uh, they asked us to grab a, three gallons of paint and paint their steeple for them. So uh, one morning... That's a lot morning, of work, incidentally. It was a heck of a lot of work. So one morning, we were up there painting, and we got through two and a half gallons and realized we still had half of the steeple left to paint. And Mac, of course, got the great idea to reach into his back pocket and bring out some of that fine Oregon blackberry moonshine that he carries around with him. Oh, the pain. And he, I said, and he said, I'm just going to dump this in. Oh, oh. I grabbed a stick and stirred it up, and we turned that half gallon into about another gallon worth of mixture, and we started slapping it up on the uh, top of the steeple there. Birds flying past him. To finish up the job. And about that time, these big dark clouds started rolling in. And then we saw some thunder in the distance, heard some thunder, and saw some lightning. And then some horses, some stallions uh, uh, came running by, galloping by. And then we heard the dog bark. And then we heard a little cat meow off in the woods. And as soon as these big dark clouds were right over us, we looked up there and we heard in a big booming loud voice, Repaint, repaint, and thin no more. <laughs> and so, with that, we'll do this song for you called The Little White Church. Let's see, one, two, three. quickly load up everything and let Ron, our, uh, uh, Karen and Ray, our wonderful camp hosts, let's have, give, give a big hand for them. All right. 
they're here volunteering for the BLM, keeping an eye on things and keeping everybody legal and that kind of thing, making sure there's no fireworks from the stage or else or elsewhere. We're going to do one more song and then we're going to really quickly pack up and head on out of here by at least 11.09, all right? You're going to give us nine minutes extra? And they need two hours to clean up the place for the next group that's coming in at one o'clock today. There's another group coming in and this place stays real busy. But remember, next year, the weekend before Labor Day, we've got it reserved already under the full moon of August 28th and 29th, 2015. So we'll be back. Happy sunny side of life. Are you sure? Okay. <laughs> oh, she's sure about that. Okay. Mac and I decided. Okay. We're staying at A. Sounds good. Good to see you. Oh, there it is. I got to make sure I have the notes for this one. Joe's brain. Well, okay. We're going to leave you with a nice little uplifting message called There's a Happy Sunny Side of Life. everybody have a great fall and we'll see you again